Hey, what is up everyone? This is Kane here. Welcome back again to TechKaran YouTube channel 1 OS, which is based on MIUI 12.5 or basically MIUI 12.6. The stable version is out here for the Redmi Note 8 users. So, if you are a Redmi Note 8 user and if you love One OS, if you have installed ever One OS, then you, if you want to install, you can. 21.10.3 official version is here. By the way, it's based on the latest stable version for MIUI 12.5 China stable. And yes, some features are not there, some features are there, some one OS interesting options are also there. If you want to check it out, you can. This is a version which we are talking about, MIUI 12.5 by 1.revtex.me. They have improved a lot and yes, they've added a lot of things. We're going to talk about all these things in this video, so stay tuned for that and make sure to watch this video till the end. And we are talking about this version which has the latest Android version 11. A lot of things have been there. Let's get started. Let's find out some things which you get in this build. Okay, so first of all, as you can see, this is the default UI which you get here. Let's just talk about this control center smoothness first of all. You can see the control center is quite smooth. It is not giving me any kind of lag still now. Of course, it's MIUI, so just don't expect much things in MIUI, especially in Redmi Note 8, but it's good enough. You can see the control center speed was not that bad. You can use it, of course, if you use it for some time and you will use install some apps, then you might feel some lags and I'll recommend you to use the MIUI 11 control center or MIUI 11 quick settings which is good also in the terms of app opening speed and app closing speed it's not that bad it's actually good it's quite improved they have improved according to if you compare it with the previous versions they have improved but right now still it's just normal and good enough it's not excellent and we have the MIUI light edition already available for you which is little bit better than this if you want to check out the MIUI light edition for it be noted just make sure to check out the video already available there in the i button or you can also check out by from by going into my channel here then the default launcher the widgets are also old one there is no widget store there is no new launcher the animations are also kind of same so yes no updations here unfortunately but of course it's not a big deal i don't think so most of the users use animations or you can see new bad new widget store but here we have some interesting features if you move on here you can see the arrange items in recent option which is of course already available in other rooms also other mui base rooms but here we have the animation style which is actually good animation style which means you can customize the horizontal style if you want to see let me show you this is the default one which i have applied and you can see these animations look quite good and here something is quite impressive here if you want to go for other options for example let me just move on to settings once again going to more we have uh, this arrange items in recent option already available i've applied the freestyle you can use the cube style cube which means like this yes it looks better of course it will just increase the performance yes i saw this if you will enable this you will see that recents will be improved the recents animation will be improved the recent speed will be improved a lot of things are good this is why i just love this build according to some things i just love these things these were some things which you get here for example in other option there are no major differences there are no major options present here but we have the one os settings if you don't know about one OS settings i made a video on one OS settings also here you have the hide options you can hide some icons from the status bar or basically some customizations which you don't get by default in this room or in either MIUI room if you move to others you can customize the folders related customizations gestures and animation options are also there and some things which you can customize if you want to and in the terms of special features we have the game turbo video toolbox etc but game turbo it's not the new one let me show you the game turbo which we have right now this is the game turbo which we are having which is based on stable as i previously mentioned if it is based on stable it does not include the new game turbo 4.0 but if you want to get that new game turbo and a lot more other new interesting stuff you can do manually by installing the beta version of security app and as always i made a video on that one too the camera does not have any kind of major differences any kind of major changes you can see almost same ui 48 megapixel short by norma etc there are no camera additions still now but we will look into it you need to check out these things 
last but not the least we also includes a one os space one os space has some apps which you don't get by default you can install firefox get apps get apps which is a very useful thing by the way i don't think so most of the users use that that's available in the china beta or oh, sorry that's available in the global ones where you can update the apps from your device me music me remote and some bloatware which is you can even install the mainly theme manager global version so that's quite good very simple this is all thanks for watching Over the edge feel like I'm floating through the air